Okay, apparently, apparently I might be catching something. But the solution is to make videos and watch video. That's, that's always the solution. No matter what your problem is, your house on fire, watch videos. Someone's towing your car, you get it, watch videos. Okay, Hotel California by Elite Bata, although this time his name is spelled Alif. Who knows what that means? Um, <clears throat> I like to save awesome things for last. I'm one of those people. Uh, however, I found another guitarist, and I want to hear them play Hotel California. So now I have to hear Alif do it first, so now I can know how to like compare and contrast. Um, no, no, nothing to tell you except for in case I need it, I put my, my steel string acoustic over there. Because yesterday, Leap did some behind the nut bins that don't sound so good on my classical nylon string guitar. So I was like, let me bust out the uh, steel string in case we need it. I guess we just strap in, right? Let's just do that. Well, he is starting off with a pick. Sounds good. First time I've seen him play with a pick. Oh, unless he's using his uh, index fingernail as a pick, which I actually do that a lot. Uh, I don't know which guitar to use. No pick in my hand. Register your index fingernail. Right. So maybe he's doing that. Could be. Sounds like harmonic minor mixed with possibly mixolydian flat two, flat six, which is just a mix mixolydian scale. Think of a major scale with a lowered two, what's up cat, a lowered seven and a lowered six. A major scale, like C major, with a lowered two, so a D flat, a lowered six, so a A flat, and a lowered seven, um, D flat. And the cat just jumped in my lap. That or harmonic minor. This sounds kind of like a mixture of the two. you want me to talk about everything he's doing because just this like last minute would take five minutes but he's doing a really jazzy approach it sounds like is this the um cover off the um eagles acoustic version i haven't heard that one in so long but i think he's using a lot of that uh so basically he's hitting a chord and then he's vamping on the chord which is soloing he's playing like a set of runs against each chord and but he's not doing the same thing every time He's not using the same scale every time. So for example, for this E part, he's using a lot of droning E pedal tones or whatever. I don't know if you want more information than that. I think it would slow things down and make it boring. Oh, that was the lowered, uh, the flat two when he was holding the F on that E chord that just happened. Dude, you got like this, this thing. There you go. Oops. That note.
one thing I will point out, uh, but I'll have to point out retroactively, you'll have to go back and listen. He does a lot of, does a really good job of comparing and contrasting certain elements. So his last cycle through the chords before he brought in this part, he played mostly bass strings, mostly strings six, five, four, maybe some three. Now with the melody, he shifted away from the bass. So it enables him to play a lot of the same chord shapes, but they have a different sound because he didn't hit the same sets of strings on them. Side note in case you I know what I'm saying in case you're here. Uh, so sometimes what he's doing to make these things, guitar playing can't be impossible. There has to be logic behind it. So a lot of times he's playing chord shapes that normally if you were just playing the song, you might bar and hold down all six strings, you know, between your bar finger and your other fretting digits. Uh, and he's not doing that on some chords. Sometimes he's dropping out the sixth string and or sacrificing the first string and using the four strings in the middle of the guitar to get a sound so he has extra digits to play uh, melody notes. <laughs> Actually right there, that's a perfect example. Right there, look at his hand. He's playing an F sharp major chord, which you would normally play like this. But he's getting rid of his, my guitar's a lot of time. He's not playing this string at all. He's using this grip. And now he has X, now if he wants, he can move this index finger around and play stuff or his second finger. He's not stuck by barring. If he bars, it locks his hand down from um, doing fancy work. Case in point, watch what he does right there. That's the exact same chord, it's the F sharp major chord, and you hear that the majority of the decoration is his index finger. Okay, that draggy thing, I've, I also like that thing too. Um, so what he's doing, I'm saying this because like I actually really loved this part of the song. I remember this from the original version. Um, well, the original acoustic version. What is that? Mine is not going to sound that dope because you do need to practice it and I don't practice it. It is a dragging of your finger across the strings. Um, this chord, baby, my tune. Enough. You can't really see my let me back up so you can see it. Right. But when you when you're coming back, use another finger and drag your next finger, and now you can reach for it again. Right, so you get. So you can go down. So yeah, now I'm taking my thumb, then back, next finger, next finger. And the closer you get to the bridge, the more metallic it sounds. Hey, 
I just want to hear that again. Those sections, if you want to play them, um, I played this song live with a band once we played the harmony section. Um, those are just this, whatever the chord name is, it's basically descending arpeggios of whichever chord is happening, and there's like a cycle of about eight of those chords. <laughs> Nice. Nice. Just because the video just finished, I want to see if I... Uh, I know it starts off on B minor. Um, but what was it? Yeah, yeah, so you got the... Uh, you have to like hit the chord and then come back with the arpeggio. That's fun, cat. Don't you think so? Hater. Cat's such a hater. Anyways, fun to hang out with Elite and uh it's crazy how so many songs, there, think about how many songs there are in the world that have lasted a, a tremendous amount of time. Like, I was about to remark on how crazy it is to me that Hotel California has been around for, what, 50 years now? 60? 50? That's crazy. Uh, but then also I was like, oh yeah, Mozart. Oh, which y'all recommended Turkish, Turkish March. Which I have not uh, listened to him play yet. So we'll get around to all that. God, I love this stuff. That's, that's it. Bye.